Father, we thank you, God, for your grace and for your love. We thank you first and foremost for Jesus. And God, for these two that are here today and those who have joined with them. God, you gave us marriage because you love us. You gave us marriage as a picture of our relationship with you, God. It's not about religion. It's about relationship. Lord, uh, we're all flawed. We're all broken. But you love us. And today I pray your love and grace would be on these two today especially. And on all of us as we celebrate this moment, this gift you've given, Lord. We ask this in Jesus' name. Amen. Our submission to Christ should be a willful, and I want to do this because you love me. You love me as I am, not as I'm supposed to be. You love me, and though I'm broken and flawed and sinful. <laughs> I knew this was a setup. <laughs> they look good. Thank you. Very nice. Oh, man. You are, you're gorgeous. <laughs> No, that's very nice. Thank you. Yep. Oh, God. I want you to be so happy today. Thank you. I love your laugh, your smile, your willing nature to give. I love you. Because of my love for you, I promise to support you, to honor you, and to continue to love you unconditionally. I promise to love you when things go wrong, when we might disagree about something, when we might want to do something different than the other, when we just don't feel good. Bailey. I love your heart, your kindness, your hugs, your, your words, words, and your love for others. I promise to be your loving friend, partner, and wife. I'll, I'll be here for you when you need someone, someone to talk to you. or listen as you do for me. I trust and appreciate you, and I promise to show you that every day. I promise to respect and cherish your being me, to strengthen when you're in sorrow, and hug and kiss you lots and lots. You are the light of my life. You have shown me more love than I have ever known. You're literally my everything. You are my princess, and I will strive to call you that for the rest of my life. I seriously cannot imagine where I would be without you. I promise to share with you my hopes, thoughts, and dreams as we grow, pray, and build our lives together with our precious baby girl. Um, with these baths, I promise to love you as my best friend, my husband, before God and these people from this day forward. You don't love her the way Jesus loves the church. So when I'm angry and I'm mad, or you're angry and mad, and we throw a tantrum to God, He still loves us. When I break my word to Him, He still loves me. When I'm sinful, when I'm messed up, He still loves me. That's the union. That's where you guys have been commanded to do in Christ. And He'll give you the strength to do that. And I want to continue this amazing journey of life with you and Drew 
by my side. With these vows, I promise to love you as my best friend and my wife before God and these people from this day forward. The cord of three strands is not easily broken, Ecclesiastes 4, 9 through 12. This is such a powerful demonstration of what's taking place here. Notice it said a cord of three strands is not easily broken. There's only two getting married today. That third strand is God who's going to hold your marriage together. You both have vowed today to be all that you're expected to be as husband and wife. Before me and these witnesses, but more importantly before God, you made these vows today, and do you plan on keeping those vows? Say, we do, if you mean it. Good. Well, if you'll turn and face the crowd, it is my honor to pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss her. <laughs> you to read these guys okay and, and bring yourself back to each other all right because you know it's so easy to say to quit and, and I want you guys to be the exception you're gonna have bad moments but I promise for every one bad moment there are 20 good ones ahead take every argument as a learning lesson spend more time loving the beautiful moments that life is going to bring you and remember this moment and this feeling right now anytime you find yourself facing the challenges life is going to bring you because if there is one thing that I know is meant to be, it's Bailey and Alex Schimpf. I just want to say thank you, and I want to raise our glasses to Bailey and Alex Schimpf. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.